Hey my lovely people. Today we making a track together from scratch, and I show you the whole mixing process and professional techniques on mixing and mastering. So you can get a step further to your dream, which is to making pro EDM tracks. So my boys, let's go. First I simply take FL keys. I am laying down 4 bass notes first that fit well together. Now I move this one 7 half notes up. And then I adding some more notes to turn it into proper chords. I just make it by ear. Yes. Done. Let's grab a lead preset to put a melody on top. Something like this could work. Let's duplicate it. And I change up the notes right here for more variation. Duplicate it again. And I switch up the part in the end for even more variation. Yes. The most essential part for getting a proper mix is that you selecting the right sounds to layer. This is very nice. These sounds are working perfect together. Don't overdo your layering though, just take a few preset that work well with each other. We also don't really need to go to crazy with the EQ when the sounds are already working well together. I just cut out the lows and some of the very highs, to make the lead wider. I take the stereo enhancer and adjust the stereo separation a bit. Now I add the peak controller and I will link the reverb to it. With this technique the reverb is more controlled and clean. Let me show you how it's done. I bring up the low cut first so only the high and mid frequencies are triggered by the reverb. More decay for a longer reverb, and right click on the wet, and click link to controller. Now select peak, and click inverted. Now the wet of the reverb is linked to the peak controller and it is much more clean and precise. To compress it I always use a bit of side chain. it's essential. Now for the chords I change up the rhythm a bit and pick a chord preset. Give it some basic processing. And sometimes you just need one preset for the chords and it works. Also some side chain and that's it. And now sub bass. Our bass for more power. And side chain. Now a mid bass. As I said, pick good sounds and you have better chances to get good results. Some distortion. That's good. Now let's mix all these elements together. First the sub and the mid bass. I always check with span if all frequency ranges are there and if nothing peaks too much. Bring down the mid bass a bit. the sub 2. Now I mix all the other elements too. I like to compress the piano a bit more, and I duck down some of the annoying frequencies to make the piano cleaner. In this range right here pianos like to have very resonating frequencies sometimes. With span I look if some frequencies are peaking too much. Maybe right here. So I grab another EQ and duck down some of the 4K frequency range for the LEDs. 
yes. At this point it try to perfectly set the volume levels up. This is a process of experience and taste I would say. That looks clean. Everything is pretty even. We need a nice progressive house kick now. I mix it nicely with the basses. Now some claps for more energy. You will see that for the drums the essential thing is that you pick good sounds. And if you do a lot of mixing and stuff you will get better and better and picking the right ones and how you set up the volumes together so that the elements sounding glued together. Pretty simple. Watch. This ride could be softer, but it's just preference. Drums are ready, now some real instruments to give it more depth. Some sidechain compression. And multiband compression to make it stand out more. We don't need to EQ it because it's very clean already. Let's pick one more. This one's beautiful. This one has some frequencies that resonating a bit. Let's bring them down, like this. Let's check. And a riser and I think that's it already my boys. And I slap the sausage fattener on the master and that's it. Guys, I hope you learned something today. I showed you everything from scratch. How to come up with a whole drop and how you properly mix it so it sounds professional. And keep in mind that my EDM essentials bundle with over 7000 sounds like presets for serum. So length 1. Vital Inspire. A couple hundreds midis that are 100% royalty free. A 1 hour master class by pro producer Severman. Is still at a huge discount. So grab it before the discount is gone. You will love it. And now, let's listen to our final result together. Thanks so much for watching, I love you.